Members of the Maryland Jewish community joined Baltimore City leaders for the lighting of the menorah. Mayor Stephanie Rawlings Blake and nearly 200 people attended last night's ceremony in McKeldin Square to mark the beginning of the eight day Hanukkah celebration. Lebanese videographer Bridget McKeady captured the spirit of last night's event. And it's exciting to see so much participation downtown here in Baltimore. It is bigger and better than last year. I guess I should have thought about that before I agreed to go up and light it again. When I was driving here, I saw a car with a menorah attached to the top of it, which was pretty cool. I, I think it's great. It's wonderful that we're able to spread the light in, in public and everybody can see what we're about. The celebration of Hanukkah has two aspects to it. First is the victory of uh, the Maccabees over the Assyrian Greeks. The Syrian Greeks wanted the Jews to assimilate and they rebelled against them and they were victorious and wanted to light the candelabra, the menorah, in the temple. And they couldn't find enough oil and so they had only one cruise of oil which they finally found. They put it in the first night, it burned for eight days and that's the miracle of Hanukkah and why we have a menorah with eight branches on it. I, I think it's really nice that with all the Christmas trees and the Christmas lights they put up a uh, uh, menorah in the middle, you know, showing our Judaism. Uh, being Jewish in Baltimore, it's a great place to bring up a family. That was just lovely. Oh, that's very nice. Very nice.